Prime, really pleased to be here today with the uh, Police Minister Bob Cameron and Superintendent Chris O'Neill uh, to talk about the way in which uh, additional transit police and better technology is helping to improve the safety of the travelling public. We've got more transit police and a multi-million dollar upgrade of uh, 3,000 CCTV cameras to provide the Department and Victoria Police with better quality, higher resolution CCTV images, images that allow Victoria Police in the majority of circumstances to identify offenders and to enable them to use that footage in prosecutions. That is a very important development for the safety of the travelling public, this much better technology, remote surveillance of the system. And in addition to that, 20 premium stations with an extra 100 staff. That's an $84 million project by the government in the state budget to ensure more security, uh, better service for customers. So all in all, more transit police, much higher resolution, higher quality CCTV, better opportunity for Victoria Police to use that footage uh, to prosecute and identify offenders, along with more station staff, more host stations, more premium stations, is a great outcome for the security of the travelling public. Can I just say that as part of our increase in police, there has been 50 additional uh, transit police, and at the moment there's more than 240, and by June uh, that'll be finalised uh, with 250. As you also know, uh, we've committed to more police, 1,966 extra frontline officers over the next five years, and the Chief Commissioner's plan uh, in the coming year is to use 200 of those to increase the operational response unit and for the operational response unit to be doing more work around the transit system.